Oh, Shiza, I missed that. Really stoked on this one. Here we go. Thank you for watching. Hey, what's up? So, I'm gonna do a Beechwood owl in a log, which I thought would be really cool because it is a very fast paced uh, relief style carving and it sells really good and it's not super complicated. So if you're just beginning, this is gonna be a great one for you. Let's get down there and we'll see what we can find. <sighs> this is the beautiful Squamish, British Columbia. <sighs> but it's so awesome here. You can see up there, there's, there's really good fishing. The steelhead are running right now. Okay. Oh, there's some nice logs that have rolled down. But these are all too big. What do we got? Yeah, it's old, rotten. Hopefully we'll get lucky. Oh, look at that big eagle up there flying. Awesome. Hey, buddy. Phew. That's a really great spot. There's lots of fish here in the, in the summer. This has always been a good productive pile for me. Whoa. Hmm. That's a nice chunk, but too small, too small. Oh, shiza, I missed that. That's nice. I am down with that. Is this cedar? Oh yeah, look at that. For sure is cedar. Yeah, this is a great piece. Check this out. Wow. It's awesome. When you come down to the river, you can find cool stuff. So, really stoked on this one. Now let's get back to the shop. And make ourselves a beechwood owl. You ready to do this? Let's go. <laughs> Welcome to Ryan Cook Carbon. All right. Oh, heavy, beautiful day. Can you believe this day? I mean, come on. It's awesome. Okay. So we're back in the shop. Put this log right here. We're gonna carve it. I mean, it's dry, which is crazy. Really nice old growth, just awesome movement. So, you know, I'm thinking like this is a really thick part. So I think the owl head's gonna come here. I think I'll either do an owl and then taper it in or just one big head. Like he's perched in the wood itself. But that's all right, let's do it. Let's go, here we go. <laughs> Wake up, baby.
Finger sander. 
battery. I love it. Woo! Touch on the eyes. Actually, you know what? Do a touch of black. Paint, fire. This could be beautiful. I just like to do the outside edges. The outside edges are great. And then up for the under. Really around this part inside because then it takes away all your chainsaw cuts. You can use paint if you want. I think I might have burnt my hair there. They have black beaks. There you go. That's going to look really good. Don't forget to sign your work. Sign it on the back. Or I'll just do it with a touch of black paint. No, it doesn't need it. Little highlight for the eyes. It's weird. I have like an old rotten paint and it works so good. That's great. There we go. Done. You know what? Why not? Just give it a little touch. Okay, 22 minutes. A very nice, quick carve owl. Let's bring it out to uh, show you in the sunlight. Okay, here we go. Beachwood owl, hope you guys liked it. Definitely click the next video that's coming up in a few seconds. Uh, you know, hang out with me. Enjoy this uh, page, my name's Ryan Cook. Hope you liked it. Carving relief style. You just go down to the beach, you grab a piece of wood, carve an owl into it, and you can sell them and make some good dough. So hopefully that helps. And if that helps you to carve one of those, smash the like button. We'll see you later, guys. My name's Ryan Cook. Yo!
You're the best, buddy. <laughs> yeah.